The European Union's 27 leaders meet in Brussels this week to consider the membership applications of Ukraine, Moldova and Georgia. As Henry Ritual reports, EU leaders also will discuss military support for Ukraine as Russia intensifies its bombardment in the Donbas region. On the eve of the European Union summit, Ukraine's president addressed a crowd in Amsterdam via video link Wednesday, telling them the EU must approve his country's membership. And I'm sure that none of us, none of you, have any doubt that Ukraine should get a positive decision. We deserve it. And we deserve it not only for our bravery and our fight for freedom. That fight rages on in Ukraine's eastern Donbas region. Ukrainian forces are clinging on to their last strongholds in Severodonetsk. Outgunned and outnumbered by the Russian invaders, they are desperate for more Western help. European Union heads of state will discuss further military support for Ukraine. The 27 leaders are expected to grant the country accession candidate status putting it on the path to full EU membership. Ukraine belongs to us. It belongs to European family. For Ukraine, the benefits of joining the EU are clear, says analyst Camino Mortera Martinez. There's a huge single market. Uh, there's a number of institutions and organizations that can help. There is money to be had. But especially for Ukraine, I think that right now, the most important thing would be to... Um, sort of have this sign that they belong uh, to a group of countries who are able and willing to stand up to Russia. Throughout the four months of conflict, Ukraine's president has courted European leaders with a message that Ukrainians deserve EU membership in return for defending Europe from Russia's aggression. But full membership remains a long way off. It can take 10 years or more. It goes by chapter, so every big chunks of policies are what the Commission calls a chapter. So it takes a lot of negotiation to close the chapter, so to have uh, the, 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 sorry, those negotiations over. And it would imply a lot of reforms on the part of Ukraine. Speaking to VOA, the United States ambassador to Russia backed Ukraine's EU membership. We support the Ukrainian aspirations to, uh, to join, and it's tragic that Russia is pushing, at the point of a gun, Ukraine closer to the West. Meanwhile, Ukraine has warned that Russia will intensify attacks in the coming days as the country seeks to sever ties with its eastern neighbor.